I actually think fiscal credibility is something very, very important. I can tell you that in the world we live in today, uh, politicians aren't going to be judged by what they say or what they promise, but actually what they do. Well, I think we're pretty happy with the budget. It's uh, built on realistic economic assumptions. That's something we always look for. Uh, the minister has uh, confirmed the government wants to get back into a balanced operating budget fairly quickly. We were looking for that. We wanted to see that, and the government's delivered on it. We want to create a situation that does everything we can to try and help first-time buyers get into that new home. And we also want to help the new home construction sector. And so this is a, uh, a proposal that will take place effective today, be effective up until uh, March 31st of 2013, and it will provide a rebate, a check, to British Columbians that qualify for ten, up to $10,000 to help them purchase their first home. Uh, I think for the home building sector, they've gone another extra mile by giving the $10,000 rebate to um, first time home buyers. I think that's brilliant. We're eliminating the provincial jet fuel tax on international flights. Now this is coming about as a result of YVR in particular came to us with a business case where they have written commitments for 22 additional international flights. Well, the jet fuel tax, I think, is important because of the Asia-Pacific strategy, and these are international flights that uh, we don't get enough of here, and, and we need them here. The airport to IVR is a major investment, and uh, it is a job creator, and there's a direct link between a jet fuel uh, tax reduction or elimination uh, and job creation for every new airline that comes in. I gather there's 100 or so jobs. We've got a small business corporate tax rate that's amongst the lowest in the country uh, and importantly a reminder that we've taken this what we define as a small business uh, which used to be earnings up to two hundred thousand dollars we now have increased that to five hundred thousand dollars over the last number of years so that the threshold for a small business has been improved dramatically. Well, our membership uh, did tell us very overwhelmingly that they wanted to see a return to a balanced budget framework and so that was very encouraging. They recognize it as an important part of having um, you know, an economic situation that, that is secure and one that encourages uh, businesses of all kind to operate and flourish. A balanced budget definitely goes a long way to doing that. Prudence, I believe, is extremely important in the kind of climate we find ourselves in today.